the height of the chairs changed, so I need to change the height of the lighting. Picture this, a place with plenty of space, powerful lights, backdrops, props, and forms for you to drape your items over. Recently, during the pandemic, um, I had lost the ability to actually shoot at my home. Uh, lighting issues, space, just not a practical solution. Sylvia Miller spends some of her days snapping photos of her stuff at picture studios in Greensboro. I do come weekly and whether it's small things or large things. The day we were there, she was trying to get her chairs in the right light. It looks great. It pops against the white. She's always hands on. She always makes sure you're taken care of. She's talking about owner Crystal Rogers. In April of 2020, in the middle of the pandemic, she and her husband Evan opened this hourly rental studio on Centerview Drive in Greensboro. Our studio uh, is rented for as low as $30 throughout the week and on Saturdays up to $60. We're closed on Sundays. The space is for photographers, videographers, and creative people in general. Our studio is really, really good for millennials and DIYers. We have a lot of people who come in and they do their shoots for their online boutiques. Uh, they may come in and take photos of their garments and put them in their e-commerce websites. For me, it was a lifesaver. I can do one-stop shop, load, unload, Perfect lighting. She has so many different variations of lighting that you can use to get that just right look. The studio does not provide cameras and does not take pictures. You can show up with a cell phone and hold your own photo shoot. We had a couple of ladies come in the other day and they did a best friend shoot and they had so much fun. It's a quaint studio where you feel right at home. The exact atmosphere Crystal and her husband wanted to create. We wanted the studio to feel like home. You know, when you walk in, we want it to smell good. We want it to look good. And we want you to be able to, you know, to feel like you want to come back. They also want everyone who steps through the doorway to be safe. There are sanitizing stations throughout the studio and signage. Uh, we do temperature, temperature checks at, you know, when people walk in and we limit the amount of people in our studio. And walk away with the perfect shot. They don't leave here until they have something good. Tess Bargeber, Fox 8 News.